uh, just a warning, this video is going to be very depressing, so be sure to grab a blanket, a uh, box of tissues, and just get ready to weep with me, because today I found this guy on the internet. He goes by Pow Envy, and he is a Roblox streamer. He streams himself uh, playing Roblox video games, I guess for his job. I would assume he doesn't have any other job. Recently, he's been documenting the behind the scenes of his life. He's showing the state of his room, his physique, his bathroom, his roach infestation, and these videos are one of the saddest things I've ever seen. So I decided to make a video where I react to and criticize him in hopes that he sees it and decides to make a change. So let's start off where it all, but actually, let's just start off with how he looks. Here is, um, I took a little screen grab from one of his videos. Literally no arms. I don't know how he, he's somehow achieved the Roblox body, but with twigs of arms. It's really unbelievable. Not, not a good look right off the bat, but as we'll see, it gets much, much worse. It all started when he posted his room tour, and I'm going to give you a warning. This is both sad and disgusting, so get ready. Here we go. Cleaning my room as a Roblox streamer. Oh. First, I get started with the bed stand. This is where I have all my waters for how, my daily hydration. How do you live like you that? All my waters? I see at least three cans of soda. You are not just drinking water. Also, side note, anyone who gets their water source from like bottles of, like cases of bottles of water, it's horrible. That, that's so sad. Waters for my daily hydration. Oh, your hydration. You see, it's cleaned okay. up. I'm getting the floor clean now. Oh. Still got a long way to go. Yeah. I then grab the vacuum. After Did you? Most everything. I don't see much vacuuming going on. I, just, I see more dots than the stars at night. After picking up most everything. Dude, you got a lot more. Still got some stuff on the side to tidy up. And now my Roblox streams are ready to resume. Oh. I love Roblox. I love Roblox. I love Roblox. Okay, first off, yes, you did clean it to some degree, but as we can see, you need a new floor, a new table, a new, ev you need new everything. Sell your fucking Roblox equipment and actually make a livable home, because even when it is clean, as he says, it's still disgusting. Yeah, you got all that stuff on your, uh, your dresser, bed's not made, this is a sad state of affairs. But um, it gets worse because he released part two and it gets there. There's a plot twist. Cleaning my room, part two. And it I'm somehow, somehow in a few months span, it got right back to where he started. And look, he stopped drinking water. It's just sodas now. My room gets really messy. What the hell room. is even that? I do, I, you could give me a million guesses in the world and I could not tell you what's in that thing. That's not very good. I found a free bag of chips and they're not even expired yet. This is the best day ever. Gotta get these trash. That's your best day ever. I think your death will be your best day ever at this rate. Facts, this milk, don't. Milk! Don't it. In what world is that milk? How does milk become brown? Milk, don't, don't lean over. It does not smell very good. Really? Doesn't smell good? Who would have thought? I don't know why. I poured some coke in it to try to make it smell better. Found my nail clip. I poured some coke in it to try to make it smell better. You ever thought about standing up and just walk to a sink and pour it out? I don't know. Maybe maybe it just never crossed. What the Dude, hell is even look that? How bad my nails get when I don't have nail clippers and I use oh, fingers. It really stop, hurts. Stop! Stop! This is not a room tour. Move on. Why did he just show his toes for no reason? What is happening? Anyway, bringing the dishes down. Got some trash bags filled up. This smells really bad. Really? I don't know what this is. I think what it was- What You know how long chocolate milk has to be sitting to look like that? Or soda, or who, who even knows? First, let's go back to the sink. Jesus Christ, bro. How does he live in this nice ass downstairs house? Are you still living with your mother? Has to. This is, ugh. Ugh. This smells really bad. I don't know what this is. I think it was you coffee You don't know what it point. is? It must, like, for you to not know what was in a cup, it has to have been lingering, simmering for at least three months. But now it's like a syrup. Look at these coffees. Some of them look bad, some look good. I think it's based on how long they've been there. Yeah, it's how it works. You think? You think? 
That is indeed how it works. You leave things for a certain amount of time, they will get worse. Jesus. This looks like syrup, too. I don't know how I'm going to get this out of the cup. I might have to throw it away. You need to... Anyway, you got the rest. You need to throw everything away. The trash bags, I'm going to go ahead and take them out. Don't forget to wash your hands after cleaning your room. It's very good for your hygiene. Anyway, thanks. He just found out that washing his hands is good for hygiene. I... This is upsetting. I'm so upset. I'm really upset. Like, ah, right, listen. If you leave an empty water bottle here and there, that's one thing. But these are cups filled with various liquids that he doesn't even know what's in them because they've been in there for so long. How do you live like this and wake up every day with a smile? But the saga continues because up next, he tries to go outside. Not clickbait. Let's see what happens. As a Roblox, you know, I don't go outside much, but my fire alarms wouldn't stop going off, so we just switch off the power. So I put on my crocky dockies and tried the Your outside. only motivation for going outside is you lost power. You'd never do it normally, huh? First off, it's way too hot out here. I'm in Texas. I, I will agree. Swinging. It's been hot as shit recently, so, you know, check the weather before going outside. But it, it kind of just made me nauseous. I didn't like it very much. The swing made him nauseous. It's probably because you don't drink water. You don't have any vitamins in your body. I really don't know why you guys hype this out. It's just not that fun. And my skin was burning too. That was weird. Yeah, your skin was burning because it's the first time it's seen sunlight in 47 weeks. That's why your skin was burning. That, that was probably the last time he's going outside too. Because he's so vitamin deficient... No nutrition, doesn't drink water, that, that, that anything besides his air-conditioned gaming chair is too much for him. It's despicable. The last thing we're going to be watching is him cleaning out his shower. I didn't even know he, he showered, which is impressive enough to me, but let's see. Taking a shower as a Roblox streamer. He, he's, he's, framing as it, he's framing it as if it's some big event, which I guess maybe like for Roblox streamers, it's their monthly ceremony. I, I don't know. A roach decided to die on my toothbrush, which was kind of rude. A what? But I mean, a who? Uh, a, a what? A roach decided to die on my toothbrush, which was kind of rude, but a roach. I wonder how the roaches found their way to your room. Maybe it's because there's 47 different articles of food and drink that have been sitting there for months. Who knows? A man does have to brush, after all. Anyway, well, I'm glad my roach you figured that one out. I somehow managed to reach the bathroom, so I gotta take this dead roach out of the tub before I can shower. Oh. I read that sending them down the drain is bad for the environment, so I just flush them instead. Sending them down the drain is bad for the environment, so you flush them. I, I don't got much hate left to give. I'm gonna be honest. I'm drained. Anyway, starting up the bath, and I realize I forgot my homework. I have Pixolve to help me with all of my word problems. It makes it so much easier. He got a sponsor. He got a sponsor and I can't. I shame on you, Pixolve. Here, homework is a breeze when you have this app. Anyway, I get my Perpetuation towel. Perpetuation of the Yo, lifestyle. I have a question. Does anybody know how to get this dried conditioner off the wall? I like to use it to trap roaches. That way, I don't have to squish them. But then they just sit there for. You're rubbing conditioner on the wall to catch roaches. He may be beyond help. I made this video in the first place just to, like, um, say he needs help, but I think he may be beyond it. For a long time. But I'm... Ah! Out, so it's that was up. That, I was not ready for that. That's That was a jump scare, and that's how we're going to end this. Um, I got a lot to say. I'm not going to lie. So, first off, as I said before, the only way you can live like this and be okay with it is if you have nothing to live for. This guy probably has... No friends, no loved ones, and only looks forward to getting the next Roblox pack opening. So I think the first step for him would be actually finding a reason to exist. Um, he obviously doesn't have one now. So that that would be a big first step. And Pow Envy, if you're watching this, I don't hate you. You seem like a nice enough person. You seem a little funny, but you can't live like this. This is horrendous. Next step, um, after finding something to live for, would obviously be just clean. Clean, 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 and really gauge what it's like to live in a situation where you're not in, in basically homeless but in a house. I think if he could just get a taste 
of what living in cleanliness looks like, he might be more inclined to do so. I just think he's never felt it before. And then the third step would just be do things that aren't in your room. doesn't even have to be outside. Just go in your living room. Say hi to your mother that you're living with at 24. Just talk to people. I think it, he just needs to escape this hibernation that he's made in his room, and he might be slightly better off. But I, there's so many. Let me help you, pal Envy. If you want to DM me, my Instagram's Tony.JG. I am willing to get on a call, give you some pointers, and hopefully we can sort you out a little bit because this is really, really sad. And um, I, I, I don't wish this life on anyone. I'd rather be dead than have this. But uh, yeah, let me know your thoughts on pal Envy. And with that being said, see you in the next one. Thank you all for watching. Peace. Orange Peanut wants you to subscribe Because he needs more money